What's up, Fish Catcher Jacoby viewers? We are out here on another beautiful morning. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm sound a little crummy, but we are about to fish a incoming tide. It's going to be come up all the way over a foot and a half today. Uh, the weather is right about 40 degrees. The cold front that came through last week is uh, gone and is starting to warm up, but it's only going to last for a couple days. And I just absolutely went over a flat right here and scared off so many redfish. I don't know what I was thinking. I figured it was still a little bit too chilly and they wouldn't be out yet, but uh, that was the wrong decision. So we're going to see if we can get on some redfish and then we're going to move to another area and see if we can get some big speckled trout. And I also wanted to say, keep that subscribe button rolling, guys. We're just adding more and more people every video. I like it. Keep it going. And it's your boy, Fish Catcher Jacoby. All right, we're going to start off with the Scented Paddler Z. This is by Z-Man. It is the Smoky Shad color. <clears throat> we're going to also put a little Procure Inshore Saltwater Gel. Super Gel. It's super sticky, super strong, and super effective. And made from real fresh bait. <laughs> I love this stuff. I'll put it on almost all my lures. It, uh, it'll disappear off your lure after a couple casts, but that oily sheen on it stays on there. So it lasts for a good while. There he is. Let's go, baby. What do we got? A little bitty guy. <clears throat> First fish of the day? Let's go. I'll take that. I'll take that over nothing. Ooh, he's uh, probably 16. I'd say he's right at 16 inches. We'll get a quick... <clears throat> Sorry. I'm still trying to get over this cold I have. We'll get a quick measurement on him. Lord have mercy. Quick, quick measurement. And he is 15 and a half inches, not legal. I will put the legal uh <clears throat> the legal curl limit for these fish for Alabama and Mississippi right here. But let's get a quick release on this little guy. Off he goes. All right, that's a nice way to start off the day. I'll take that. Not the big one I'm looking for, but yeah, we switched it up <clears throat> to the uh, Z-Man. Hold on. We switched it up to the Z-Man um, Diesel Minnow. <clears throat> it's a red, uh, red toad is the name of the color. It's uh, <clears throat> kind of green with red sparkles. It works really well. I switched off that scented Paddler Z because it's a really light colored one, that one I was using. And I'm starting to get back in darker water, so I like to use darker baits for darker water because that's the color of what the bait fish are going to be. Good work, though. There he is. First fish, baby, let's go. Not a big boy. He's not a big boy. All right. Well, that is not the one. But I will take it. Good gosh. Got some hooks in his mouth. All right. That is a tiny fish, my friends. In the water he goes. We switched it up to the Mirrodin gonna try it for a minute and don't get very many good bites i'm gonna switch back to the bottom until i get a little further back in this creek that i'm fishing and uh if you say hey fish catcher jacoby why don't you got a uh, you know a leader on there with a uh, um swivel <laughs> that's because fish catcher jacoby didn't realize he was out so for now i'm just gonna use my little uh broken rod to see if i can't catch a nice fish on it well, that's one spec Not the one we was looking for. Oh, there's another one. Oh my God. Look, he came back for it. What an idiot. Tiny little fish. Oh, there he is. Nice bite. That was a good eat. Not a big one. Absolutely demolished that mirror. Do you know, watch him come up and hit it. Ah, 
a little bit oh, quick release just the way i like it this is a little bit bigger of a fish there's a pile of little bitty specks in here oh i'm getting absolutely slammed There he is. <laughs> they are crazy right in here right now. I'm about to put on a top water. Oh, that's a nicer one. All right. So that's more into uh, getting a little bit closer to legal size here. He's probably right about 14 and a half. I'd say, give or take. They are something else in here right now. Man, you had to mess up your lure. Oh, he's got, he's got parasites all up in his mouth. Dude, how did you even do this? There we go. All right. That's a nicer fish. Probably about 14 and a half. They are absolutely wild right in here right now. When they start eating the Miradine every cast, I'm just getting hits. Yeah, they're, stu they're a little stirred up right now. Will this be the first? Oh, he slammed it. Dude, he just absolutely slammed it. Holy crap. Little bitty guy. Ah, dude, he just came up and smashed the crap out of it. Looks like I found the right temperature water for these fish to be very active. Every cast with this Miradine. There he is. Finally, found us a trout. Feels like a nicer sized trout. Oh yeah, that's a nice one. And I don't have my net accessible. Oh God, I'm an idiot. Ooh, finally found a nicer fish. I'm gonna see if we can get him in the net here before he throws this hook. All right, come on. Oh God, oh, that's a nicer fish. Oh. Oh. All right guys, we finally caught us a nicer spize <coughs> speckled trout here. I believe we missed another one about the same size a second ago. I'm obviously probably not gonna put that in a clip because who wants to see that? I mean, come on. Y'all know y'all don't wanna see me miss them. Y'all only wanna see me catch them. Let me fix the camera. What we got here? That's a nice little fish. I'd say he's probably, pro well, I'm gonna say 17. Right on the money, baby. He's right at 17 and a half. It's a nice little pound and a half fish. It's a very good eating size fish. It's about the size that I want them. Uh, oh God, look at the mouth on that guy. A very pu <laughs> beautiful yellow mouth. We got him on the Z-Man diesel minnow. And let's see if we can't catch us another one. Quick release. He should be ready to go. Oh, no he's not. nice quick release and somebody over there is catching them there's some guys that i see out here all the time sounds like they just got them in the nice pick too Mm, there was a bite.
<laughs> there he is. Not a nice fish. Maybe not that big. Oh yeah, keeper. I'd say he's 15. Beautiful fish. Oh, we're starting to find those better ones. Oh yeah, beautiful fish, cold fish. Let's get a little show off for the camera. He's all tore up, probably from spawning this year. Something big just blew up. We got a quick release on him. Z-Man for the win, baby. The Z-Man Diesel Minnow. This is the Redfish Toad. It's done caught two nice keepers. Got him. There we go, baby. Oh, nice trout. All right. What do we got here? Ooh, not that big. Definitely a keeper, though. All right, baby. Ooh, don't shake your head too much, friend. Come here. Not that big. Oh, right. well, you know. I'm not gonna flip him. Ah! All right. He was definitely flippable, but I barely haven't looked. So, that's that. I barely got that guy. Nice, Sue. We'll get a quick measurement just to see if he's legal. Da -da -da -da. Oh, yeah. Right on the money, baby. That's a nice little 15 inch fish. Uh, by the way, do not hold them like this. They do have very sharp teeth like that. That just hurt, but I just wasn't even thinking about it because I usually lip redfish. But yeah, those hurt when they, uh, those little sharp teeth get you. All right, another nice fish. So is that three or four keepers we caught now? Maybe we're starting to find the little money, money spots. Got him. I don't think he's very big. No, he's not that big. Might be another keeper. Yeah, that's probably... That's probably more like a 14-inch fish. If he's 15, he's real close, that's for sure. But that's a nice, pretty healthy fish. We get a quick release. Boy. Z-Man's tearing him up, baby. All right, guys, that was the end of the video, and I'm going to show you what we used what i use today it is the z-man diesel minnow it's four inches long this color right here is the uh, uh red toad and i use a quarter ounce jig head i recommend probably using a swim bait hook but uh i like to use the jig heads because i've said before in other videos it's my personal preference but yeah the jig heads can cause problems with these lures because they're not really made for it uh other than that guys yeah we caught a good bit amount of fish only got that one little red i really tried on the reds in the morning i spooked off a big pile of reds that were back here on a flat uh, early in the morning for the wind picked up and then a crab boat came through and i was like oh well i'm gonna go try for specs but either way we had a great day i hope you enjoyed it hey guys i also forgot to show this mirror dean that was what we were catching those smaller specks on but everything else the redfish and um uh the m bigger size specs and keeper size specs we caught on the uh diesel minnow like i said we started off with the center paddler but i ended up changing it and whatnot and then also my favorite stuff to use is pro cure inshore saltwater super gel it works really great it says it's super sticky super strong and super effective <laughs> but it really does work great i use it on all my lures especially in dirty water but right now it hasn't been raining that much so the water has actually been very clear like right now i can see down like four or five feet and it's just crystal clear but either way guys that's enough talking i hope you enjoyed the video don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button and it's your boy fish catcher jacoby